Hey, 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 Scorpio. This is your sacred scribe here ready to do your reading. So this is going to be a reading for my Scorpios, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, and North Node. This will not resonate with everybody, of course, but hopefully it will with you. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe right down below there, Scorpio, if you would before you leave. I do appreciate it. And thank you so much for all of your likes, shares, and subscriptions. If you guys are interested in a personal reading, that way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs, information can be found in the description box below. Make sure you're clicking on that link in the description box, Scorpio, if you are interested, as there are scammers about the community. And know that you will always see my face in a reading, as well as receive an unlisted link that you can utilize forever here on YouTube. So don't forget to comment. I want to hear from you guys and hit that notification bell. That way you get notified whenever I upload a video or go live. So your overall energy, Scorpio, is the sun. So happiness, that is the happiest card in the deck. You have the Knight of Stars, the Empress, the King of Wands, and the Eight of Wands. So definitely you've got passionate love coming in from afar here. It could be a fire sign, definitely. Or this could be an empress. Empress or emperor. Because if this is the same person, the empress and the king of wands. This person is balanced in their masculine and feminine energies. So this has been coming towards you slowly. But I feel like there's communication that's coming in, Scorpio. And coming in quickly. Tell me. And it's going to make you very happy. Tell me about the sun. <laughs> the Eight of Swords. Why are you all up in your head? The Knight of Moons. Okay, and the Nine of Moons, which is Cups. So this is your wish fulfillment. This may be somebody that you know, and I say that because you're all up in your head with the Eight of Swords energy. So let's see. Let's see what the Kipper has to say. Whoops. Despair. That just flipped over. I'm going to get another one. What else for this? Oh, you've been waiting. You've been waiting. So this has made you sad. Perhaps you've been waiting for this to happen, this communication, this person to come forward here. Let's see. Tell me about the Knight of Stars. The Knight of Stars, the slowest moving knight in the deck, however, most reliable. So we have the Six of Stars. There may be some, this may be two people then. Because the Six of Stars is Juggling Two. That's my card for Juggling Two. You have the Page of Wands and the Three of Stars. So I do feel that one of these people you do work with. So a Fire Sign and a possible Taurus or Libra. Now they could both be at a distance. This could be why possibly you're all up in your head with this Eight of Swords energy. Because there's two people. Maybe somebody's coming in when you're with somebody and you weren't expecting this person coming. You were and you weren't. I'm going to have a kipper. Family room. Mm, this sort of... Huh, I feel like, Scorpio, you were headed in one direction. Even though you were waiting for something, you decided to go in one direction. But then this, this situation comes in and it makes you rethink what you're building here with the family room what is it who is this empress strength the five of swords oh okay so this may be somebody from the past here and the full moon hmm Definitely somebody from the past. So something is going to be illuminated here. Now, it could be communication. I want a card on the five of swords here. Three of moons. Was there a third party situation involved in this? The five of swords is frenemies, right? And the three of cups is celebration with friends. Hmm. There may be somebody around that's interested in you that's jealous of this possible relationship. I wouldn't 
I would keep it quiet. This Five of Swords keeps coming out tonight. Mm, sudden wealth. I would definitely keep this quiet because your energy is strong and I do feel it's attracting abundance here, especially with this Empress energy. Tell me about the King of Wands. The Four of Wands. The Hanged Man. Let's see. Ooh, this person wants stability with you and Six of one so okay scorpio maybe more than two people here because you are getting a lot of attention somebody wants forever with you they may even want they want marriage with the four of four of wands it may be this king of wands mm, this person is of high vibration i also feel that they hold a high position Wherever it is that they work, if they don't own their own business, then uh, uh, pff, I'm feeling, yeah, like corporate sort of energy, that type of, uh, that type of energy, if they don't own their own business, because it could be that too. All right. What is this eight of wands? Uh -huh. The wheel of fortune. This is all happening in divine timing when it's supposed to happen. There's a lot of that happening right now. Divine timing for people. Death. That's you. King of stars. So that's Taurus energy. The seven of swords. The star and the ten of wands. Okay. You need to be honest with each other. And that's what I'm getting from the seven of swords. Okay. Because this can be something. This can be a relationship that is transformed if if you want it to be because it is coming in divine timing here hmm i'm not sure which one is divine timing though because this eight of wands isn't being specific about who this is i mean it could be the empress with the king of pentacles here being taurus energy if it's a taurus but it doesn't have to be because this other individual the king of wands i'm feeling is of high authority here so they are stable and they do have money. All right, let's get a kipper. Let's get a kipper. Ooh, thief. Who's this thief? Child. Unexpected income. There may be something that you don't trust about this individual, this King of Wands. Why is he here? Eight of Stars. This is a person that you work with or that you mm, is, is sort of related to work. So maybe you contract them out. Maybe you met them at work. They Something is connected to work. The chariot. You may not trust them as far as money is concerned. I don't know why. Because it does feel like this person has money. I'm not sure what you don't trust. With Maybe you're sensing childhood trauma here with this individual. If you are very intuitive, you may be picking this up. And it's sort of transmuting. It's transforming into uh, distrust. What's this person's intention that Scorpio is distrusting? Hmm. This person is wishing to seek wisdom about themselves and manifest something with you with a magician card, okay? So I don't feel that this person is being distrustful. Uh, they may need to do this childhood work, especially if it's come out. And maybe that is connected to money and that's what you're picking up on. Wow. All right. So what is your advice here? Let's see what your advice is. We have the Six of Swords, Temperance, and the Seven of Moons. Okay. Let me get a kipper. Before you make a decision here, 
Yeah, because this is the next leg of your journey here, Scorpio, okay? Before you make this decision, make sure that you get rid of any illusion and confusion before you move on, okay? There needs to be a balance within you before you move forward and make this decision. That's very important. So make sure you're in alignment here. Yeah, and your advice is change. For a change, do something you usually do a certain way in a different way. So what is it that you do all the time in the same way? They're wanting you to switch it up and do something different. You are a fixed sign, Scorpio, so that could be challenging for you. Start small. So Scorpio, I hope this resonates. Please drop a link below, share and subscribe if you already have not if you're interested in a personal reading. That way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs. Information can be found in the description box below. Make sure you're clicking on the link in the description box, Scorpio, if you are interested as there are scammers about the community. And know that you will always see my face in a reading as well as receive an unlisted link that you can utilize forever here on YouTube. YouTube. Don't forget to comment. I want to hear from you guys and hit that notification bell. That way you get notified whenever I upload a video or go live. Have a fantastic day and I will catch you on the flip side on the dailies. Namaste.